Hello people of YouTube, I am Amalgastus, and I hope you had a Merry Christmas. I hope everyone out there had a Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, whatever you celebrate. And luckily, Mesozoica, which uh, a game I've been waiting on for a long, long, long time now, because like I said, Jurassic Park Operation Genesis is my favorite game of all time. And this is pretty much a spiritual successor to that, but luckily, Mesozoica gave us a nice Christmas gift, and put out a little demo, demo V0.1 yesterday, it's way 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 early in production so whatever you see here in this demo is not final by any means, it's just a little thing that they put out and so far it looks brilliant, it looks great, um, music, if you can hear that, I don't know if you can hear that, um, it sounds beautiful, this all looks great right here on the screen. So, we're just going to play a little bit of this, show it off a little bit. Um, it was kickstarted back a long time ago. I don't know if it was over a year now at this point, or not. But I'd know, I don't know if I talked about Mesozoica at all in the video that I put out, my little channel update thing. But, I said that I wanted to kick off my channel with that. So, it's, I don't know. It's still a while until it comes out, until it ends up coming out, I think. But we're just going to give this a little try. I don't know more information. Um, welcome to our world. The one we have worked on very hard for for the past couple of years. I was going to read that in a John Hammond voice, but I decided not to. Just, I don't know. So, pretty much I think this is just going to be saying... I'm not going to take the time to read it all. You can pause it and read it if you want to. But it's talking about that this isn't final and this is what is in this build it says ability to place paths and purchase buildings and decoration for your park visitors which are going to look like blobs roam the park you can create habitats for the animals um, purchase and look at the first five assets they are I don't remember what they are I know Therizinosaurus that's the only one I really remember so oh okay so we're just going to start the demo loading a new park, cleaning up the park so you can start all over. So I'm not expecting, I've seen, I saw, let's see, on stream, because they do periodic streams to update people, but I saw that a little bit of what this is, so I, I know, oh well, okay, that was faster than I expected. So see, these are the little visitors, these little blobs right here, let's see, just general, okay, I don't know how to rotate, oh, there you go, okay. So, down here we have pause button. Oh, they actually do have money. I figured it would be infinite money, but it looks like they do actually have some money in. You can see this is the number of dinosaurs in your park, and this is the number of people in your park, I assume. That's just a delete button, I, I'd assume. And I met... Okay, there we go. I was going to say, it didn't let me click off of that. And let's see what we can build. We can build small hatchery, herbivore feeder, and a water source that's pretty... A small water source. Um, some of these are kind of touchy. Trees. We can build some cool-looking trees here. Some more... We can put some rocks in our exhibits. Put paths down. We're going to be using a bunch of that. Low security fence. And some decorations. Wow, this is actually a lot more than I expected in this build. Okay, so let's look at... Oh, these are the buildings. Okay. Oh, that's probably in the hatchery. It's probably the hatchery menu. So, first of all, let's hurry. Let's just get a nice path here. Purchase. Um, let's just take this out a little bit. I don't know. It's hard to scale. Um, I'll take it out a little bit more. I'm not. I don't really plan on our exhibits looking that fancy. I'll make them look a little good, a little bit better than just a square. But they're going to be a couple different shapes probably. Let's go like that. Let's just go over for now. Um, and it is kind of late at night, so whenever I'm playing this. But still, better than nothing. Okay, so this is just going to be our first exhibit. Hopefully it's big enough. I would... I don't really want to give my dinosaurs a small exhibit because that would be pretty mean. Okay, let's. That actually looks kind of small now. Looking at it, looking at it now, it looks kind of small. Hmm, it's gonna be fine. Buildings, dinosaurs. We can put in a hatchery. 
Oh, that's how you rotate, apparently, the middle mouse button. Let's put a hatchery back here at this corner. Or no, I can put it... Can I rotate it around so the... Okay, yeah, that's what I want. Perfect. That actually, I didn't plan that at all. Okay, so here are the dinosaurs that we can pick from. The Stegosaurus Stenops. I don't know if these are their actual scientific names or not, but the Stegosaurus is a type of armored dinosaur that lived during the late Jurassic period between 155 to 150 million years ago and is the namesake for the entire... for, for the entire... okay. Triceratops horridus. Bearing a large bony frill and three horns on its large four-legged body and possessing similarities with the modern rhinoceros, Triceratops is one of... Okay. Hypsilophodon foxy. Hypsilophodon is among one of the smallest herbivores to be found in Mesozoica. The English native prefers to live in large groups like a flock of birds. They. Yeah, I know that it's... I know it's obviously not supposed to be like that. There's supposed to be more text and that's just a bug, but... Okay, the Therizinosaurus, which is one of my favorite dinosaurs. Chiloniformis? I completely messed that up, I guarantee it. There's a <coughs> Sorry about that. Therizinosaurus is a large, pot-bellied, herbivorous theropod that lived in the late Cretaceous period, around 700? Or 70. Myasaura... Pebulsorum? Myasaura means good mother lizard, and this creature certainly earns that name. Fossil evidence suggests that Myasaura... Okay, so I think, should we, I think we're going to go in order from, I don't know how that was happening, but, okay, I think we're going to go from the least exciting, in my opinion, to the most exciting. And two of these dinosaurs on here are two of my favorite dinosaurs, the Stegosaurus and Therizinosaurus, like I said. So, first off, I think everyone can, and um, maybe not everyone, but a lot of people would agree that the Hypsilophodon is probably the least exciting out of all of them. So, oh, here you can... They have a lot, this, you can see here, they have more, that's where the text is. Can we rotate this around at all? No, I can't. Um, they do have some little information over here, and I would like to purchase three of those. No, let's just purchase all five. So, are they going now? Are they, is it making them? I don't, Harambe Park, <laughs> Okay, I like that. It's going to be a dead meme here soon. But So is it actually making the Hypsilophodon? Oh, no. Oh, I know what's wrong. I paused. Okay. That makes sense now. I was like, wait a minute, what's wrong? But yeah, I paused the game, so that's why. Duh. Um, let's just work on a little bit of an exhibit here. I assume they would like smaller trees. Why do they have two different pine trees? And two different Scots pine. They have different pictures too. Huh. I don't really know why they did that. And I can't zoom in when I'm like this. We're just going to put some pine trees around. Rotate them around every once in a while. Make it look somewhat nice. It's going to be hard to see any of the hips left on. This is running really nice. It's on the highest settings. And my computer, I mean, it's not a great computer. It's not a ter It's not a bad computer either. But it's like, it's. I know that that's what, something they were really proud of, the developers, was how well it runs. So there, it's really showing that right now. Um, I don't, why is rocks under vegetation? I don't think, okay, whatever. Um... It's mossy granite rock. I think that would look good, and I can't zoom in again. I forgot about that. I probably put too many trees in the exhibit, didn't I? Okay. Um, oops, didn't mean to do that. Oh, I keep doing it. Okay, well. I got my money back for those, luckily. So, it kind of takes away from the look of the exhibit whenever there's no grass in it, but look at this little guy. Let's look at him. Can I can I click on him? I can. Oh, I can name my Hypsilophodons too. It zooms farther away actually whenever I click on him. I don't know if I like that. What's control? Oh! I didn't know you could do this in this build. You can be the dinosaur. That's so cool! Oh my gosh! I didn't know you could do that! 
I knew you would be able, I knew they planned on adding it in the, like, I didn't know they did it in this build, though. That's so cool. I love this. This is my new, this is so awesome. The graphics, it looks really good. This game looks super amazing right now. Just, even without the grass, without any of the textures, or without not textures, it has textures. Listen to it. Okay, this is really cool. Okay, that's, that's awesome. Um, what should I name it? Should I name, no, I'm not going to go through and name my dinosaurs right now. I don't think. I might, if I get, okay. So, those are the Hipsloft Dons. They look very nice. This, man, I like, I, I love that. I can't wait to control everything else. Okay, exhibit number two. Let's build some more pathing, maybe? I'm going to make this one, that exhibit's fine for those, but I'm going to make this exhibit a little bit bigger, this paddock. I'm going to make it, um, do something like that. Is that, yes. That's not, that's very, oh no. That's not, uh, symmetrical. Oops, did it again. And I'm not Britney, sorry, Britney Spears, please don't sue me for copyright or something like that. I don't know if you can. Okay, that looks, is that symmetrical? It's close enough to symmetrical. Buildings, dinosaurs, oh, wait, I need to do this. Okay. I am going to put that right there. Luckily, there's still room. And a water source. I'm so excited for this game to come out. I hope it comes out sometime soon. I don't actually know if they need those in this build, but eh, I'll put it in there, just SNGs. Okay, dinosaurs, wait, oh, fences, okay, that makes sense. The fences are under the fences. I never would have thought. Okay, see, I don't, I don't completely avoid making any completely square exhibits kind of hard to do when you have a grid, but it's not impossible. There are no... Okay, yeah, there's just these for now for visitors. I'm, I'm going to put some bushes in with the hips loft on. I cannot put bushes in with the hips loft on. Oh, yeah, I can. Okay. Cool. I know I place... Okay, I know. Oh. I know I placed something out there, it's fine. No, dinosaur number two. Oh, I, amenities? A hamburger kiosk? Okay, I'm, I know I'm getting very sidetracked. I, I, I'm gonna get that, I promise I'll get dinosaur number two down. Okay, dinosaur number two. That's what I was looking for though, was the amenities. And I could find them for some reason, but I found them now. There's that, and... Uh, I do not like that. I can place a herbivore feeder. I don't actually know. Is it herbivore or herbivore? Place that right there. Um, water source. Okay. Now, do I... Money actually isn't... No, money isn't going to be a factor. So that's good. I, I like not having to worry about that. Number two most boring dinosaur. Which, none of these dinosaurs are boring, just putting that out there. But the second most boring, I think most can agree, is the Myasaura. I'm going to purchase two of those, because I feel like that's a good number. Those are the... They're like, um... Oh my god, why why is it blanking? Uh, you know what, I'm, I feel stupid. Um... Hadrosaur. I think it's a hadrosaur, right? I think it is. I'm pretty positive. I feel, yeah, I feel really dumb that I couldn't think of that. I promise I know how to dinosaur. Now if it could hurry up. Well, I guess we could start working on the exhibit a little bit. Most of these exhibits are going to look kind of similar. I can get black hash in this one. I'm not going to get as many trees. Okay, that looks like enough. Um, get some, let's get some, some of this. 
every once in a while. And what else? Was it under decoration? Yeah, I like ferns. I don't know why they wouldn't have that under vegetation. I mean, it is also decoration, I get that, but it would make more sense for it to be under vegetation considering it, considering it is vegetation. And let's look at these little guys. Or, they're not really that little, but let's look. Can I? I'm gonna. Okay, there we go. I want a good look at it. Um, I think this looks. I, I think the model looks great, personally. Um. Oh, I. I would like if you could zoom in a little better. If there was a little bit of a better system to do it, but to zoom in on the, just the dinosaur. Because you can't scroll in this. I'm trying to scroll in. Its rarity is epic. Hmm, I guess it's really rare. I didn't know that. I didn't figure it would be a really rare dinosaur. But, yeah, I think it looks really nice. Now for my favorite part. My new favorite thing ever. Controlling him. Yes. Yes. I love this. It walks a little bit slow. Wait. Yeah, he walks a little bit slow. It's, I mean, he's bigger, so he's obviously going to walk slower. The exhibits, yeah, I can't wait for them to actually put, like, a ground in. Okay, so that's the Myasaura. It looks pretty nice. We have three more dinosaurs to go. First is the... I don't remember what's next. I give up on my thing. I'm just going to start making them square exhibits. I probably should have made the more exciting dinosaurs have the better exhibits, but it is what it is. Oh, I'm messing this all up. Okay, there and there. We put this one in the middle because we haven't done that yet. It's not actually. It's off center and it's not even symmetrical like with the exhibit. I can put these right there though and it make it look a little bit better, maybe, possibly, perhaps. Who knows? Probably not. Oh, now that's annoying. Can I move? No, I can't move that. Third dinosaur is the Triceratops. Because, I I mean, I already said the other two are two of my favorites. <gasps> oh, yeah. I forgot. You can do this. Okay. They have different skins for everything. Why is it... Did I purchase one of those already? I guess I did. There's Graceful Vengeance and Piercer of Heaven. Oh, I like that one. Okay. So we bought three of those. And we will look, go through and look at the other skins as well. Um, I just I did those two, so let's do the Scots Pine. Oh, I really like the Scots Pine. I think that looks really nice. Oh, that looks really good. Okay. There's some of that. Uh, vegetation rocks. Dusty, stanso dusty sandstone rock. I don't think we're actually going to get through all the rocks, so... I'm going to also put another type of rock in this, the flat sandstone rock. And there's that. He has a very rocky exhibit. Where is my Mr. Triceratops? While we're waiting on him, I guess we can look at the other skins. For the Hypsilophodon, you know, he doesn't have any other skins. I'm pretty sure the Myas... Uh, no, no, they didn't. Okay, so I didn't actually miss anything. I thought I missed something whenever they came, whenever I was looking there, but I guess they don't just don't have any other skins. Okay, so this is almost finished, the first one. I really like how everything looks. If I haven't made that evident already. Wait. Oh, well, I feel really stupid now. I thought it came out the other side. I guess not. Look at how nice of a structure, how nicely textured that is. I mean, it, I don't know, there's something, there's just something about it I really like. I also like those... And let's look at our Triceratops, if we can. This is the first skin, I believe, the not one that's not Piercer of Heaven. I like the Triceratops. He, I don't know, he looks a little bit fat, like bulgy, I guess. <laughs> not really the right word to use in that situation, but I mean, I couldn't think of anything better. Um, Pudgy, maybe? I don't know. It's just his proportions look a little odd, but he looks really good. And, I don't know, 
if he would actually have color on his uh, horns. Yeah, I'm gonna say horns. Stabbers. His, yeah, his stabbers. That's what I'm gonna call him. But he looks really nice. He's very, he's pretty big. I think he would be able to break out of this fence if he really wanted to, but I doubt he wants to. He's a triceratops. He's a nice guy. Let's go ahead and control him. He is very slow. Oh, I love that. I love the little... I love the running on two legs. Or the... Yeah, the running like that. Like the galloping. Um, it takes a little while to turn. But... Oh, I just pressed E. I've been playing too much arc. Pressed E to get off of the Triceratops. Oh, they even have turning animations. That looks really good. I mean, it, it doesn't look really good. I, it looks good, but... Considering they actually have turning animations is a good thing. Usually they, games like this don't. I mean, usually they don't even have the ability to control a dinosaur, so... It already has more than those, but... I'm waiting on that. We can look back at that last trike, so we can see the skin. Okay, next dinosaur. Oh, security fence. We'll just do pretty much the same thing. Okay, buildings, dinosaurs, small hatchery. Um, herbivore feeder, water source, small, and let's buy ourselves a little stegosaurus. We can buy earthy brown, leaf green, magma, New Year's wonder. Oh, oh my gosh! Look at all these. Oh wow, these look so good. Earthy brown is eh, six out of ten. Oh no, five out of five out of ten. Leaf green, not fire red. Leaf green is um, I give that a seven out of ten. I like it. I really like that actually. Magma. Ooh, that's like eight and a half out of ten. Not aqua. Not team aqua. Team Mag Pokemon references like that. I don't know if they actually meant to do that, but yeah, magma is like an eight and a half out of ten. New Year's Wonder looks a little odd. Looks kind of crazy. Eight out of ten, though, I'd say. I like it. Yeah, it's it's really it doesn't look any, like it's it's not realistic at all. I don't think. Sunset Orange, another eight out of ten. I really like how that looks. It looks it looks nice. It looks um, professional, I guess. Tribal Yellow. Seven and a half out of ten. Yeah, seven and a half out of ten. I like how the colors mix, but it's kind of plain, like down here. And vintage. Eight and a half out of ten. It kind of looks like the New Year's Wonder. It's the same color palette, but it's just not as mixed. It's more green down here. And this, I really like. Okay, so we're gonna get. What ones did I say were my favorite? Not earthy brown. We're gonna get one leaf green, one magma, um, one vintage, one sunset orange, and one New Year's wonder. And we're gonna look at all those while those are making, while those are getting created. We can look at that's not no. Was it this one? Yeah, this is the one that was a different skin. Okay. It's hard to, it's kind of hard to see. I could pause it and look at it. But, yeah. It looks pretty nice. Uh, excuse me again. I'm tired. Uh, have we looked? Yeah, Scott's... So I'm going to see, is there actually a difference between that and... Uh-oh. I forget which one I... <laughs> I forget. Which one I made. Is there a difference? This one over here has a bigger hole in it. Um, I don't know if that's like a mistake. I'm gonna look. Okay. Wait a minute. I, I need to know which one I picked. Okay. I did the top black ash. This time I did the bottom black ash, which costs $600 less than the top one. Okay, they are different. Okay. Yeah, those are, you can t definitely tell with that, that they're different. Okay. So, we didn't use this pine tree, I don't think. Can you, no, you can't, I was hoping you could just hold, but, I mean, I didn't expect you'd be able to. K, 
Okay. Put some rocks in. I don't remember where we left off. Let's put some lava rock in. Those are big lava rocks. Just kidding. I don't know how big lava rocks actually are. I just know the little garden lava rocks. For some reason, don't do any gardening whatsoever. And volcanic rock. Because why the heck was not? This is the leaf green skin, which looks really, really nice. As our visitors would be able to agree. They they do not look nice, I will I'll give them that. They need a little bit of work. They don't look like they're doing too well. They need to eat a little bit, it looks like. Man, I love Oh, I clicked on the wrong thing. You can see a little Myasora across there. Wait, what wasn't Hipsloff done? All the other tiny. Man, I love this game. I can't wait for this game to come out. These are very slow. We'll give them that. Hopefully they don't need to outrun anything anytime soon, but with that tail they'll be able to fight off most things. Um, where are, are any of the other ones out yet? Oh yeah, here's a magma one. Wait, why is it? No. If I click on it... No, that doesn't work. Okay. I'm trying... Okay, pause. I'm gonna see if I can get a screenshot right here. Thumbnail if I can. It's not a really good angle, is it? Not your best angle, Mr. Stegosaur. I don't know if you can turn the UI off or not. I wonder if there's another one. I better... No, there really isn't. I'll just... I know what I... I know what I'll do. I probably won't get any of the dinosaurs, but... Unless I can find a really good angle of one. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I know this is well this is giving you guys a chance to look at them too, I guess. No. I'm not gonna get a good angle. Unless can I get it up on the rock? And nope. Okay, if I don't get this one I'm giving up. Oh, I'm giving up. Okay. No screenshots. Oh well. Man, this looks really nice. I love this. So relaxing. I'm actually running out of money, but luckily we only have one exhibit. Luckily we only have one exhibit left. Oh, that's I don't remember which one. Is that the vintage? It's really good, really solid. And I think we are gonna give this last dinosaur the best exhibit out of all of them. I like how this part's turning out. It's very compact. I'll I'll give I'll give myself that that I made a very compact park. Um, this is a nice big, oh, well, I don't know what that was. It must not like to go out that far. Or do I not have enough? No, I have enough. Oh, okay. I, I'll stop. I won't make, I won't make another exhibit that big. Don't worry. Um, small hatchery. We'll put that back here. Another feeder. Put another one. Because it's a pretty big exhibit. I clicked on the hatchery again. Water. Oh, and I can't wait to see the skins for this. Oh, they're kind of expensive. Oh, there's only one skin. And uh, that's kind of disappointing. Oh, I love Therizinosaurus. They're so creepy. And they're so, I don't know, they're just so therizinosaurus I love it. I think we are going to put a bunch of trees in this exhibit. Just kidding, I bet we don't, because I want to actually be able to see the Therizinosaurus. That would be nice. That's what I like to do whenever I go to a... That sucks. Well, <laughs> we're not going to put a bunch of trees in the exhibit, because I don't have any money to put a bunch of trees in the exhibit. How's our hamburger? Oh, that action is not available. Can't click on it. Well, this is a very boring exhibit. 
until the Therizinosaurus gets in there, then it's, it will be very fun. I keep looking at that like it's the door, but the door's actually over here. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Yeah, I forgot, I forgot the little saying there for a second. Mm -hmm. Ooh, this is so relaxing. So I will say, I think out of all of them, I was most disappointed in the Myasaura. I don't, I, disappointed isn't the right word, but I think it is the worst looking out of all of them. By, by no means is it bad looking. But I was really surprised with hips off done. I think these little, these little boogers are pretty fun. Because they're fast. You can get up closer to them, I feel like. I don't know. Just there's something about him I really like. Why is this one not over here with his friends? Oh, they're eating. Yes. I love this is just so pretty. It's so pretty. Hipsalophodons. I actually yeah, I like the Hipsalophodons. I was kinda disappointed in the Triceratops. I'm I'm once again disappointed isn't the right word, but it looks it's not like I expected it to look really. Stegosaurus was brilliant. I love the Stegosaurus. I think those look amazing. And finally, maybe, are they in here? <gasps> yes! A Therizinosaurus. Man, that looks... I love Therizinosaurus. Look at those little claws. Look at them. They're so scary. Those are things of nightmares, folks. This one actually might not be a bad one to get a screenshot. If I can, I said I would give up. I'm not giving up. I need one. I want one. Mm -hmm. Uh, no. It looks like I'm not gonna be getting one. Okay, so I'm giving up again. Is the other one come out yet? Yes. Man, these look so good. These there's. I love these. Look amazing. And as always, we are going to walk around with them. They're kind of slow. But they're not as slow as the Stegosaurus, I don't think. They're about the same speed as the trike. They can turn decently well. I don't actually know... Ah! Can you, can you do that with all of them? Did I click? There's a little roar thing. Do all of them have a clicking... Yeah, they make their noise. Okay, Stego, what do you sound like? Oh, were you asleep? Was he asleep? There's the Stego. Uh, did I? There's the Trike. And I doubt these make much of a noise. Actually, we heard them. I know I heard it when I was walking around. Yeah, because it was, it was loud. And here's our park. I'm going to zoom out as far as I can. Okay. Well, this is Mesozoica Beta. No, not Beta. It's pre-Alpha, I'm pretty sure. Alpha point one or some, point zero one or something like that. It's very, very early. And everything that was seen here could definitely change in the future. But you can download this for free off their website. This... I might link that in the description if I remember the link to it. But, uh, yeah, this is... I can't wait for this to come out. It's going to be a great game, folks. <laughs> I sound like a sports broadcaster. It's going to be a great game, folks. Okay, but for real. Uh, yeah, this is a great... This is going to be a great game. I can feel it. I can't wait for it to come out. I, if it does come out, which I'm, I have full confidence that it will, and I'm not that busy whenever it comes out because I do go to college in like a few months so hopefully I'm not that busy whenever it comes out and I actually have time to play it a little bit but I'll do as much of it on the channel as I can I think it's gonna be really fun thank you for joining me folks I am Amalgasis and I hope to get some more videos up soon but if not uh, you can I'm sure I'll get some up in the future thank you for joining me bye bye